Welcome to Conditech Hamburg Harburg, everyone. My name is Yasmin, and today I get to take you on another exclusive tour of the site. You will not want to miss out on it, but what is so special about Conditech Hamburg? The teams we're going to visit today in particular are those in charge of compounding and producing suspension systems for rail vehicles. But there is another exciting aspect about the work carried out here in Hamburg. Some of it evolves around developing future technologies relating to hydrogen. At the tech center, we develop projects in collaboration with all the business areas, product development teams, and we develop concept designs up to the qualification of the products, uh, performing all the required testing. The hydrogen technologies will be disruptive in the future, this means that every part of the infrastructure will change. And for Contitech, means that we have new growth field opportunities in developing new components along all the value chain, from production to the transportation, the storage and utilization of hydrogen all over the industry. Hamburg is, so to speak, the go-to place when it comes to material competency, especially when it comes to compounding. There is a huge variety of rubber compounds that are produced here and then later further processed either in-house or externally by our customers. Let's take a closer look at that. The first step involves dosing the raw materials. The bulk raw materials are dosed directly from the silo into the mixer, and the smaller sized raw materials are weighed directly into bags on our automatic weighing system. In the compounding center, we fill the mixer from above with all the raw materials that are delivered in containers. Once the ingredients have been combined into a homogeneous compound, the mixer transfers it to the rollers, which we use to produce the supplied form. In other words, a compound sheet. From there, it goes to the release agent wetting unit and into the cooling channel for drying and cooling. We then place the compounds on a pallet. The final processing step takes place in the finishing department. There, we run the compound through an extruder with a downstream gear pump and a screener to filter out any suspended solids still in the compound. What distinguishes our Hamburg location is the fact that we can handle a huge range of variants. This puts us in a position to offer even small order quantities at economical prices. We also have our own color mixer here, so we can produce compounds in any color. Another highlight that awaits us is here at the Air Spring Systems, namely the hydro bushing. Now this one here is a so-called hydraulic wheel set control bushing and it's used in the primary spring stage in rail vehicles. Its main job is to absorb vibrations when in motion and also to help prevent derailment. Another job it has, amongst many others, is to make sure that wear and tear of the wheels as well as tracks is reduced to a minimum. So naturally, there are a lot of requirements and they're not only diverse, but at times quite complex. In addition to that, the safety standards that also need to be fulfilled are quite high. But you know what? Why don't we hand it over to our Conditech experts to learn more? Behind us, we can see the blending extruder, which we use to blend our compounds. With the hydro bushing, we can obtain the exact values we want from the initial compound. In this case, we use this blending extruder exclusively to produce the defined blank. The blank has a defined size and a defined weight. We have different forms of vulcanization depending on how large and complex the component is. At the top is a transfer chamber where the blank is inserted. The press then pushes the blank through the hole into the cavity of the mold. The hydro bushing isn't finished yet, it still has to be assembled. This completion process requires several assembly steps, which are performed using different machines. As soon as we have completed the assembly, we carry on with the filling process. Each bushing is then filled with fluid, which we produce ourselves. This allows us to influence and determine the stiffness and viscosity of the fluid. In the sweep test, the bushing is then excited at a certain frequency and the dynamic stiffness in the driving direction is tested in each individual frequency range. 
The bushing has a very special property. Its stiffness can increase 15-fold from static to dynamic within the bushing. The fluid enables us to switch from low static stiffness to high dynamic stiffness. The products made here need to meet very high requirements, and that can make production quite complex at times. But that's exactly why the know-how of our materials experts is so very pivotal for success. The future is being made right here. But that's all for today, everyone. Thank you so much for joining me for my tour here at Contitech Hamburg Harburg, and I hope you found it just as exciting as I did. I'll see you again soon. Bye.